Now follow me. No, no, I'm not turning my back on you just yet. After you. Huh. I know you'd be putting that gun to the back of my head telling me about the rabbits. <laughs> hey, play nice, boys. Yeah, come on. We're almost through. Come on, let's move it along. They'll be looking for us. Is there any book cutter doesn't know? Mm-mm. That's scamp. Looks like this thing should spin, doesn't it? This is more than just a crypt. Yeah, the damn room looks like some kind of ancient device. Where's my notebook? You gave it to Talbot, don't you remember? What? No, I didn't. Yeah, you gun too. Oh, bollocks. <laughs> <laughs> All right, we need to figure out how to get it spinning. Look at this channel. It looks like they were meant for water. Ooh. Mm. Since Cutter found it, it is technically the English channel. Aha. Uh -huh. Alright, who brought a canteen? Let's get this going. Mm -hmm. No, no canteens? Are we just gonna have to spit to fill this up? Let's all start spitting. Alright, who here is the, the leakiest? <laughs> Sully, just just jog around this place a couple times, and then just wring your shirt out. Yeah, that'd probably do it. Mm-hmm. Oh, the lighting's so pretty. Yeah, it's pretty nice. See anything up there? Do do all these statues have indigestion? I think so. Yeah, I bet we can light these. They look like some kind of projection. They're positions on the globe. Let's get the other ones lit. Yeah, if you light everything up, and that gets things moving, then we have fully crossed over into Zelda territory. There's like one extra step in this, but it gets pretty close to Zelda territory, yeah. There's one left. I also like their flaming uh, back ridges. <laughs> yeah. It's like a mohawk of fire that goes all the way down to your butt. Wow. This one. Incredible. The beams don't line up with anything. Let's keep looking. Been a while since we saw a treasure. Yeah. There's that coin, but that was about it. I, I, is that the water? Not sure. Please tell me that you see them too. Oh, yeah, I see them. Whatever you do, don't let them touch you. Really? Just stay in the firelight. What are you doing? You should be able to make it over that brazier if I run for it. You won't. I'll clear the way for you once I get there. If you get there, you're mental. We have to get the water flowing. You have a better idea? If you throw the torch down there, you might be able to light the brazier. Throwing torches. Oh yeah. Grab another one. Try again. If you mess up throwing one of these torches, another one just spawns where it, the previous one was. Well, that's handy, I guess. It, it, you know, they're torch dispensers. Those ancient peoples sure knew their stuff. Yeah. I guess the Crusades weren't that ancient, but still. <laughs> yeah. They were even dumber than the ancient people, so it's more impressive. <laughs> Well, they had the priorities straight. They need lots of torches, torch dispensers. So are you actually timed? Like, if you don't get, like, within a certain amount of time, they will catch up to you and bite you off the, the pillars, off the beams? Yeah, yeah, if you're just sitting around in between those safe points, they will eventually start biting you. And then, like, they start biting you, and Nate can't keep his balance, so he'll just fall off to his death. At least they can't get you right here. Yeah. Oh god, they're flying spiders! Nice one. 
Oh, that was pretty. Mm -hmm. Ooh. Oh, hey, it's one of those things they have in lobbies. Yeah. The lobby thing. <laughs> All right, get on the other crank and help me open it. Can you spot the treasure? Let's give it a gun. I can spot the crank. He's over there holding a torch. <laughs> there we go. Ba dum bum. Mm -hmm. Alright, you know, maybe we have to swim it What's the matter, Charlie? Oh, kitty don't like getting wet. Only. Only his grandma gets to call him Kitty, Drake. It's very, <laughs> it's very sensitive. And again, the whole Kitty got wet thing is a thing Nolan North sneaks into the Uncharted <laughs> games always because it's a thing one of his oh, kids I said once and he thought it was really funny. <laughs> it is funny. Yeah. So there's a treasure <laughs> up here. For this one, you have to catch it while it is falling. Oh, that's messed up. It's yep. also a Campbell soup can. Yeah. Uh, cause you can dive in water, but it's not like a, it's not like a, you dive underneath and you can swim around thing. It's just like a, a dive and then you come straight back up thing. It's, it's like the, the dive in like, uh, Ocarina of Time. So you can't actually, okay, once the treasure more. falls to the bottom, you can't actually dive deep enough to grab it. Oh. All right. Let's All do right. Mm-hmm. So the whole torch thing was to get a protective barrier from the spider holes. Yes. What? Uh. It started to spin. Oh, it's rotating itself pretty well. Just have a sandwich and take a minute off. Yeah. Go on, give it a spin. So then you just gotta line up this map up, uh, which is actually harder, harder than it sounds because you actually have to use both analog sticks to turn this thing, and sometimes you'll accidentally get some... You'll get it going in one direction, then it's hard to make it stop and go the other way. <laughs> so it, sometimes it can take a little bit to line that up. Nice job, kid. You did it. Incredible. That's gotta be the entrance to the inner crypts. Do you know if this globe was based on uh, world maps from the period? You know, I don't know. It looks like it might be. Some, but of, some of those really wonky inaccuracies look like that could be the cause for it. We got a Crusader era globe. Yeah, I wouldn't be surprised if it is. The the non-existence of the Americas, for one thing. <laughs> yeah. Tag. Tag. You're it, Wall. All right, we're looking for a knight's tomb. Just like we found in France. Now, if my hunch is right, he'll be buried with the other half of our amulet. And that means they're long lost twins, <gasps> separated at birth. Wow. Whoa! That's uh, pretty <laughs> Chloe. <laughs> uh, I really needed to get that treasure, Chloe. I don't know what it is, but I needed it. Oh, you, you achieved your next rank in the Boy Scouts. Good job, Drake. Mm hmm. Is that it? Yeah. Just like the one in France. Amazing. Yeah, brilliant. Let's get it open. There it is. What did I tell you? Let's see the other half. Yeah, about that, uh, Talbot has it. What? I, I told you how he ambushed us at the Chateau. That's when he took it. Well, why did we even bother then? Hold on. Give me a little credit. There. <laughs> and with the inscription complete, we know exactly where to go in Yemen. Thank you very much. Nicely done. Yeah, yeah, all the same. I think I'll hold on to this one. <laughs> all right, let's get the hell out of here. Keep looking. Oh, shit, they must have followed us. We better hope there's another way out of here. Oh, there's a draft over here. Hey, come here. Yeah, 
Yeah, I can feel the breeze. Awesome. Please be an outside wall. It's got some give. Charlie, help me with this. Yeah. Guys, we don't have much time. Come on, go! Yes. Well, thanks very much. I'll take that. Drop your weapons. Yeah, I don't think so. Well then, what a dilemma. We seem to be equally matched. Until the rest of my men show up, that is. We can wait. Oh no. Guys? Charlie? Oh, god damn it. Now oh, that changes things a bit, doesn't it? Now drop your guns. Why don't you go for Carter, shoot him? No. Wait. Just stop. Okay? Now that's better, isn't it? Shoot him. You son of a bitch. Carter, pull the trigger. My pleasure. Run! Head for the tower! Might have given us a wink or something. can't make it. Okay, what can we do? What can we do? Charlie! What the hell? <laughs> you didn't get very far, did you? Hand it over. Piss off. There's nothing we can do, kid. Jesus, this is unbearable. Oh! Uh. Oh, Carter. I had such high hopes for you. <laughs> yeah, right. It's true. You had potential. Now, well, it's funny how things work out, isn't it? You betray my trust, and now we find ourselves here. As if it were in the cards all along. Don't move! Don't move! Oh, Jesus, my leg! Don't touch it! It's broken! I know it's broken. Just easy does it, mate. Hang on. Nate, look at this. Oh, what the hell? This way! Okay, we can't stay here. Just leave me the gun. I'll kill those bastards. No way. We're getting you out of here. Come on, get up. I got him. You got him? You cover us. Okay. How is that possible? I shot him right in <laughs> Cutter is so delirious from his injuries, he forgot to consider that he could be wearing a vest. Mm -hmm. Just the existence of Kevlar. Yeah. So the, the Gmall, or Gmail, I don't know how you say it. G the, the Jamal. The, yeah, the Jamal. I love the Jamal. Uh, it has a scope. Uh, it's it's okay. Uh, the problem is because it shoots very quickly in, in three bursts, it, each shot is weaker. So like with a pistol, it would take three shots to a dude's torso take him out. With a, uh, the, with the, the, Jamal. The, the Jamal, it takes six, six shots, so two bursts. 
Also, this dude with the shield has one of the Smith Micros, the, the Uzi things, and those things tear through your health very quickly. So it's kind of hard to get around those dudes, and I also have no grenades, so... Oh dear. Yeah, this part is a little difficult, because they, they throw two shield dudes at you here. But at least you can still do the thing from Uncharted 2, where if they take enough shots, uh, they fall over, and then you can just ramp it. <laughs> and then take their That's shield. That's always the best. Yep. Sorry, Jamal. I have a new friend. <laughs> Please exit through the gift shop. Also, if you... I don't know if the shield, like, dynamically models damage, because once, you know, if it... Also, these dudes take four fucking smacks with the shield to die. Just <laughs> fall over already, good lord. Um, I don't know if the shield dynamically models damage, because if it does get shot enough, it will break. But uh, mm -hmm. that dude, when he dropped down and fired his shotgun, Help he fired the at the door. top right corner of that shield, and it bent when he got shot by it, so I don't know. Nice. Also, you can wear the shield like a turtle Come shell on, now. That's to, so cool. To block shots from behind. Sorry, Charlie. That's fantastic. It's like the best cape ever. Mm hmm It actually works fairly well too, uh, especially if you do it. Use use that tactic during a uh, multiplayer. I've actually saved myself from dying a few times just by wearing the turtle shell. <laughs> well, if you're on team deathmatch, you just do like a whole Roman phalanx oh, thing. Oh man, that'd be so great! <laughs> just march down in formation. Oh, that'd be great. Also, I got really lucky with this grenade throw. <laughs> And armor dudes take a lot of shots to die if you're not trying to get get their hat off. But I, I had no real way to go for their head with that weapon, so... Pick, pick up the greased gun, it's so slippery. Ah! <laughs> Nate grunted there because he got nicked by the very tail end of that grenade's hitbox. Like, even after it was, like, dissipating. It was still hey, there for a second. he's not the only injured one. I'm, I'm cool too, and I'm still fighting. Yeah. Uh -huh. Take that also, look at those dudes. They threw their grenades in the sink. They are grenade bros. I like that we always find some bros somewhere. <laughs> you know, they're ha hammer bros. They're grenade bros. We've still never found battle buddies quite as uh, unified. <laughs> <laughs> no. Oh, did you turn on the next-gen filter? Yeah. Okay. It's pretty next-gen. So, are you gonna have to drag him all the way to the airport or something? <laughs> <laughs> Where's the end point of this? This music's just gonna keep playing, but we'll just be, like, walking on a country road with nothing around us. Come on, we gotta get the hell out of here. Uh, okay, okay, the bus. We're taking the bus. Well, that won't attract any attention. Morning. Not worth the price of admission, folks. Here we go. One. I got this. You take care of him. Uh, they come. Sully, get us out of here. Looks like we lost him. All right. I'll find some place to ditch the bus. Great. You doing all right? Oh, fabulous. <laughs> that was too close. He'll be okay. No, I mean the whole thing. It just isn't worth it, Nate. Let this one go. Oh, no, 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 no. You can't just give up. If you let these bastards win, after this, 
I will never bloody forgive you. But you are, Charlie. There's no way I'm letting them win. What is it with you? What are you trying to prove? I'm not trying to prove anything. Right. So it's a plan, kid. Uh, I guess I'm going to Yemen. You up for it? Of course I am. All right, we gotta find a quick way in. No hassles. Think I might know someone we could call? Who? Oh, no. <laughs> no, no, no. You got a better idea, I'm all ears. What about... No. Fine. Make the call. Elena Fisher, foreign correspondent. <laughs> hey, Sully. How you doing, sweetheart? Oh, no. Sorry, that's sort of frowned upon here. Oh, right. You two can hold hands, though. <laughs> How are you, Elena? Good, thanks. You, uh, you look great. So, against my better judgment, these permits will get you through most checkpoints. Okay, great. Oh, and I shouldn't be worried about what's in those bags, right? <laughs> No. Yeah. Not yet, anyway. <laughs> All right. Remember, you're journalists now. So try and act respectable. Think you can handle that? I think she's talking to you. <laughs> so what exactly are you two reprobates up to? Uh, it's just a little historical research. Right. So that explains the big rush? Exactly. No cursed treasures? Nope. No diabolical warlords? No. You are the worst liar. What? You are. Oh, come on. We're not going to start Excuse this, me. are we? Just... The car, where is it? Oh, it's over there. I'll just take the bags and meet you. Mate. You're still wearing it. I, yeah, I am. <laughs> it helps in this part of the world. Oh, really? Seriously? Don't flatter yourself. <laughs> I see you're still wearing yours. What? Oh, oh, yeah. That's what this is all about, isn't it? You don't understand. I finally proved it. Drake lied about his route through the East Indies. 400 years ago, he came here. Why, Nate? That's what we're here to find out. No, I mean, why this obsession? I'm, I'm just worried. I can take care of myself, all right? I'm not talking about you. What, Sully? He would go to the ends of the earth for you, Nate. Just don't ask him to. Come on, that's not fair. What is that even supposed to mean? What's that? Yeah. If you could just drop us at the edge of the city, that'd be great. Not a chance. You two are my responsibility now. I'm not taking my eyes off of you. <laughs> <laughs> 